Hello to all of you, and thank you for being back for Lesson 218. We're nearing the end of the first part of the book. I am not a body. I am infinite. I am eternal. I am causeless. I have no beginning, no ending. I just am, and that will always be so, because I'm still being that outflowing of that which is causeless and eternal. And then this big statement, only my condemnation injures me. And we think, well, that's not true. All kinds of other people injure me. I've got proof for all the bad things they do. Well, remember, we always hand the script to everyone. That's one way to say it. The other is to say they are being a mirror of what's going on in my own mind. Another way to say it is my grievances, as we mentioned in the last lesson, provide a template or an outline, so to speak. I then view something or someone else through that template, and what I see are those grievances. What I see is my condemnation, either directed toward myself or someone else, but I'm always going to see in my so-called outer life, which isn't really outer, it's all happening in mind, this exact picturing of my grievances, no way I can stop that process from happening. So my condemnation, all of this rat's nest of grievances, keeps my vision dark. It keeps my mind clouded, my safety gone, my emotions a mess, and my behavior in words will only be the thing that I can see. My behavior, words, or someone else's behavior or words. I've lost track of the light. It says, with my sightless eyes, I can't see the vision of glory. I can't see the light or the brilliance because my grievances have made this big wall up. That's one way to say it. Or it's kept me from seeing what's true. I can only see what's false. But today, I can, if I choose, behold this glory and be thrilled. I wouldn't just be glad. I would be thrilled beyond anything to see this light. The only thing that's in the way is not another person or not another thing. It's my own grievances making me blind. So, no matter about all that madness going on in my mind, I'm still not a body. I'm still free. I am still as loving and precious as always. Okay, keep that in mind. Nobody hurts us but us. So we're the ones who are 100% in charge of stopping it. We thought we had to stop everyone else first. That's not true. I stop, they stop. Guaranteed. Have a great day practicing this. I'll see you later. Goodbye for now.